But anyway, there was this guy and he came into the gym and half, half his butt was hanging out. Now, in his defense, it was the nicest butt I've ever seen in my life. I've been moving like a hot mess. Right? So there I was staring at this man's butt because I thought if I had that ass, I'd wear even shorter shorts, to be honest <laughs> you, with you. You'd wear a thong. I, I'd be in a, in a tennis skirt that didn't fit. <laughs> That's what I'd wear, right? Always bending over for stuff. I mean, he had the perfect ass, right? Uh, and I thought to myself, buddy. like, how there's, there's so many things that you cannot say. I thought it would be probably okay if you went up to that guy and you were like, those shorts look so hot on you, sir. They look, yeah. they look unbelievable on you. If I went up to a woman and said, those shorts look so hot on you. I'd be thrown out of the gym <laughs> in a yeah, second. You'd have a handprint across your face. <laughs> yeah, sure. right? Yeah. Right? <laughs> and then I just started thinking about the things that people wear at the gym. I just started sort of looking around and I was like, what are the things that women wear in the gym that just don't translate? Because there are certain things while I'm perving out, just it doesn't even have to be the gym. It could be in life. Mm -hmm. like. It is very hot for me, and I think for other guys, probably even women mm -hmm. as well, when a woman walks into a situation and you can kind of see her through a shirt. Mm, for, yeah, it's, I love that. It's very sexy, yeah. right? However, it doesn't translate to guys, <laughs> right? So what are those things where, like, you would never say to a guy, like, I can see you right through those shirts <laughs> it just doesn't work right <laughs> like what are other things that you'd be you... like okay okay <laughs> thanks lady thanks lady <laughs> break i don't i don't i don't ever ever walk out of the house and go oh my god my nipples are hard <laughs> oh my god you can't see my nipples i need i need those pasty cover-ups <laughs> Like never even crosses my mind. Right. What are other things clothing wise that just don't translate men to women, w women to men, like that women can pull off that men just can't. Um, another, like, I guess like mesh or mesh. something <laughs> like Yo. this, that mesh top. Yo, like, Kevin, that mesh top is hot on you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that bro. mesh. Bruh. Yo, bruh. <laughs> Killing it. Yo, your nipples are poking right through those holes. Super hot. I can, your chest hair is coming right through there. <laughs> <laughs> you look like the other side of Velcro. It looks awesome. <laughs> but yeah, you'd never be like, oh my God. <sighs> like I, I would easily say, I would turn to you in any situation and be like, oh my God, half of her ass is hanging out of those, that, those shorts. It's so hot. Now you say that, I but hear. say it as as a man. Hey Steve. No, to me. <laughs> oh, hey Steve. No, to me. My name isn't Steve. <laughs> like you're pointing out a guy. Oh my God! Look at his ass is hanging out of his jean shorts. That sounds like something disgusting, right? <laughs> sounds like I'm in the wrong part of town. Right. <laughs> like yeah, there's something wrong. Like roll with down the window and see how much money he wants for a BJ. <laughs> Oh my God, look at that guy's camel toe. <laughs> God, the way those balls are caressing right and left side, that's... That is a hot camel toe on him. <laughs> oh, would, wow. that, would that camel toe be... How would a camel toe be on guys? Would that be a sack? Is that what that is? I mean, I guess, yeah, just separation of the testes. Yeah. I guess. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> Here's one. Um, I was going to say that I can see like the everything, like the outline. I can see the all of it through those Lulus. I can, yeah, yeah. Because usually, when when a woman is like, I can see his penis through his shorts. <laughs> like it's it a negative. A, yeah, it's a negative connotation. Right, but when a guy is like, oh, I can see right through those shorts. It's the complete opposite, right? Yeah. 
Why? I don't know. But I mean, I'm not opposed to seeing a guy's uh, like when they wear those um, basketball shorts mm-hmm. and they kind of drape down and you mm-hmm. can see a bolt, an outline of a bulge. I kind of like that. I think it's hot. I, I agree. I cannot pull it off. Uh, <laughs> I, like I said, I was still want to get um, underwear made that gives falsies. <laughs> so it has just the outline of the head. Right. It doesn't have to be the whole, the whole thing. But um, yeah, that I I I think that it is. But for for other women, I think it it's it's not as sexy as we as men think it is. So your impersonation of it was spot on. What? Oh, it's like oh, you can see. Yeah, like ooh, that. you can see. Oh God, you can see his through his shorts. It's <laughs> disgusting. I know that because I had an ex who said that to me. We were on vacation in Mexico, and we. And we wound up at a hotel where, this is a true story, a bunch of porn stars were staying at the hotel, right? Mm -hmm. And immediately I was like, I am the luckiest. (laughs) Like, who would have picked these days? And there were a bunch of porn stars. And this guy, there was like two guys and it was like five women. And it was like, and this guy gets out of the pool and he was wearing basketball shorts as as his swimming trunks right Mm. and he gets out of the pool and the the water is outlining his oh my god it was huge right so immediately i'm like oh my god (laughs) and he gets out of the water and i immediately look at like did you see that and her reaction is disgusting and i was like what (laughs) that thing was perfect (laughs) What are you talking think, about? And that's when you called off the wedding right then and there. I mean, <laughs> close. <laughs> close. Lose points. I've been at the gym before and I've seen up uh, guys' shorts. Like, no, what? that's not true, really? Yeah. You sell penis? Yeah. I can't imagine any penis is in a good state when you're at the gym. Like, work out, working out naked is, would not be a good workout. Well, it was like a loose short or, or like you, how he cut the, the liner out or something like that. But I've seen it before and it's not really like, oh, I can make it out what it is. It's just that thing of I can see in your shorts I, and I see skin and stuff. Mm-hmm. It's not like you can really see everything. But yeah, your brain goes, ah. It, did it make you like more nauseous? No, I liked it. Oh, you liked it? Of course I did. Oh, I'm going to take my, my out at the next gym session. <laughs> You see what happens. I mean, I, you know, I was like, I was on a bench and the, or I was, pro- I was probably on the floor doing stuff uh-huh. and a guy walked by and I could see up his shorts or he was laying down on a bench and I saw up his shorts. Do you think something. he was doing it on purpose? Maybe. I hope, I hope now looking back, I'm like, maybe he was. There is so much wrong with you, but I wish there was more of you in the world. I really, <laughs> really do. Like I, <sighs> It's just not fair. You know what I mean? I know. It was LA me. too. I was like. It was in LA? Yeah. Oh, he was definitely doing it on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There was a guy and I don't know. I just, I, he happened to be masturbating in the middle of the gym. I don't know. He was. Yeah. And then another time on the subway, same thing. Guy was masturbating right while he was riding the subway. Right yeah. next to me. Who I knew? mean, that used to happen on the New York subway all the time. I mean, that was that's a common common thing. Like, but they're not well. I mean, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, because it's not like that's breaking well, the law. To... Yeah, <laughs> there is a there's a fine line between laws and <laughs> being mentally insane. Right. Right. Guy in LA Fitness being racy no i mean there is there are laws against a lot of things because people want to do them but Uh, they don't want to do them because they're mentally insane oh it's because everyone would be doing it unless there was a law in place right (laughs) then the train would just be like i i'm gonna until i get to work i don't know if i wouldn't (laughs) master on a train if it wasn't illegal i don't oh don't know it's so dirty i i know but you'd be like eh, i gotta run one out <laughs> I got time. I got time. i'm caught up on my reading it's a boring ride <laughs> what else are you gonna i do? gotta go cross town 
Yeah, I got time. <laughs> and now catch the A train. I got porn. <laughs> you do. Yeah, with no law against it. We're going to rub one out. Oh, my God. Can you imagine if there was just, like, one train a day that it was, like, the, the 3.30 A train? Or I don't even know anything about New York trains. But like, yeah, what was, that, what was that movie where one night a year you could do whatever you want? Purge. Right. So uh, what we do is it's the purge train. <laughs> the purge yeah. train. The purge. It's the perv. It's the perv train. <laughs> right. One day, one, one, one train a week, you're like, you know, you're getting on. Whoa. You know what train this is, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, He's I know. He's got lube already. Yeah. Why do you think I wore my onesie? Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. I know what train it is. I got loose pants on. <laughs> oh, you brought gloves. Smart. <laughs> When we go to the gym, right, uh, mm-hmm. I'm always thinking about sex, as most people are. Um, that's not true. But, uh, <laughs> but I do often think about sex when I'm at the gym only because I am not entering any competitions, nor am I there to run in a Spartan race. I am there to look good naked. Oh, so that it is, makes you think about sex. That is specifically why I am at the gym, because I want to look good naked. <laughs> that is my sole reason to be there. If there is a health benefit to that, yay me. <laughs> right? Bone density. Woo! Bonus! But if yeah. I see myself in the mirror and I think, oh, I look sexy, that's really what I'm going for. See, that's where men have it easy because as women, we go to the gym. I mean, I don't wear makeup to the gym. Mm -hmm. I'm sweaty. My hair doesn't look good. Mm -hmm. I'm like, you know, you guys can be like, I'm pumped. I got a little moisture. I'm I'm glistening. I'm looking good. And me, I, the last thing on my mind is sex. Only when Mm -hmm. do I spot you? Mm -hmm. Do I think about that? That's very sweet and probably (laughs) a lie. However, I am going to point this out. When you go to the gym, along with a lot of other lovely ladies, you wear the tiniest, tightest little shorts that I have ever seen in my entire life. (laughs) Okay. Yeah. Okay. So when, when there are women that go to the gym, they voluntarily wear the tightest, tiniest shorts you can find in a department store, which I, I, I want you to continue to do. But I don't wear them because I'm like a video fitness blogger, like trying to be sexy. I literally am wearing them because they're, it's hot and I like tiny shorts. We don't care. Okay. <laughs> we don't care. But if you expect guys like me or anybody else to go to the gym and you are wearing tiny, tight Lululemon shorts where I can see the outline of your and you turn in my direction and I'm in your, and I look for a nanosecond, a nanosecond, a nanosecond, because I can see the outline of your vagina. Mm -hmm. I am going to look for a nanosecond more because I am a human being. I don't mind it. And I'm not trying to say I don't do it. I just don't personally think about sex because I feel like I look disgusting. Okay. I, it's not really the point of any of this. It's not even really why, why I got into this, oh. but there is a point as to what people wear at the gym Yes, and what we ran into the other day. Um, <laughs> when we were at the gym uh, a, a week ago or two weeks ago, there was a guy there and he was wearing the shortest shorts I had ever seen in my life. Now, this isn't uncommon for a female. It really isn't. Right. Um, There is is this awkward situation that I used to always find myself in at the gym because there used to be this girl that used to go there and she would wear next to nothing, which I'd be a huge fan of (laughs) if she didn't work out next to her mom. (laughs) If she wasn't wearing such sexy things, uh, and I didn't feel like her mom wasn't there, like, don't look at my daughter. <laughs> um, because, and, and by the way, she always, always, her workout always consisted of, how far can I spread my legs apart and stretch? She was limber, that one. Right, and she let everybody know. <laughs> it's very difficult to not think of <laughs> sex 
works <laughs> when a a girl in Lululemons, where I can see the outline of everything, is doing that on the floor. Yeah, it's 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 almost impossible. Okay. Everybody's human. So now we all we all see these gym videos and these these influencers that are doing these videos now. And they're like, oh, my God, creeping out on me. <laughs> you're looking at me. I'm wearing barely nothing, but you're creeping on me. Log on so you can look at me wearing nothing. <laughs> How dare you look at me? I'll link comment. I, I don't. Ha I don't have the protection of of being at home by myself. I'm actually here in person. I don't know how to be social at all. I can only do this through text. So stop it. <laughs>